It's an underwater paradise, but the coral reefs circling the Indian Ocean island of Mauritius are in danger. Record sea temperatures combined with a strong El Nino put these reefs at risk of coral bleaching, which could kill both the reefs and the marine life they sustain. In fact, we saw that the temperature in the month of December was virtually the same as the temperature in February and March last year. And February to March is the hottest time of the year, so we can see that the hottest period has come forward over time. Corals rarely survive in waters above 30 degrees centigrade. And once they die, it takes years for them to regrow. The first global bleaching event was in 1998 and the second in 2010, both in years marked by El Niños. Mauritius escaped these bleaching events, but oceanographers are worried about the coming year. If ever that phenomenon reaches Mauritius, it will take us 15, 20, 30, 40 years for us to recover. This is a global phenomenon. We've seen, for example, that El Niño starts in the Pacific, but with the south equatorial current, the impact will also be felt in the Indian Ocean after a few months' delay. Mauritius' underwater world is its main attraction, bringing in a million tourists a year. As the threat of El Nino looms, worsened by rising sea temperatures caused by climate change, conservationists are left watching these coral reefs, hoping they'll be spared.